All right, now what we're gonna talk about is hip rotation. Previously, we talked about creating your solid base, you know, having your feet a little bit wider than shoulder width, shoulder width apart. We've talked about your plant foot, how you, how you wanna set it up. Now we're gonna talk about hip rotation. Now what is hip rotation? It's basically that. That's all it is. Now there's a couple different parts that go into the hip rotation. We have obviously your back foot that is pivoting on your toe, but we also have your hips coming through the zone. Now, a lot of people make the mistake they don't use their hips when they're swinging the bat. They're just basically, that's it. That's all they got is this little bit of movement right there. Most of your power in hitting comes from this vicinity right in here, from about your abs to your knees. You got your thighs, you know, all the ab muscles in there, your hips, things like that. So what you wanna do is basically make sure that you can get your hips all the way through. You don't wanna close yourself off. As you can see, I am pretty much perpendicular to the pitcher. My hips and my chest are facing exactly where the pitcher would be at. That's what you wanna do. You don't wanna make it go too far, go out like this, because again, then you're pulling off the ball. You know, your head's going over this way. You wanna just make sure, boom, right there. Your hips are pretty much perpendicular to the pitcher, and that's hip rotation.